When is chest pain an emergency? Hi, I'm Dr. Sara Zafar and welcome back to my channel. We all know that a healthy heart is the key to a long life. Chest pain is one of those symptoms that should never be ignored. While it's true that sometimes chest pain can be caused by some pretty benign and inconsequential conditions, but it's also true that chest pain can be a five alarm signal that something very dire and life threatening is about to happen. Chest pain could be as serious as myocardial infarction or just a muscular pain. Did you know? that chest pain is one of the most important emergencies affecting the male population more than the female around the world in today's world people are so much engaged in multiple unhealthy activities that its incidence rate is increasing every year so it's important to talk about it because all chest pains are not due to an unhealthy heart chest pain can be caused by a number of different medical conditions some minor and other serious moreover symptoms of chest pain can vary tremendously from person to person and condition to condition remember it can be as serious as myocardial infarction leading to a heart failure or it can be just a muscular pain we can differentiate the real cause of chest pain by examining the presenting complaint of the patient because it's not always the heart creating the problem sometimes even a minor chest pain may be a sign of coronary artery disease cad in fact up to 30% of heart attacks are accompanied by symptoms so insignificant that people doesn't even recognize it referred to a silent heart attack so when is chest pain an emergency if you or your loved ones have a complaint of chest pain and you cannot understand its cause then watch this video till end because in next few minutes you are going to evaluate your chest pain The first order of business is to make sure you visit a doctor who examines you carefully with proper history checking and by performing tests So now we are going to discuss signs and symptoms of every condition which leads to chest pain because it's not always the heart there are many causes of chest pain but most importantly chest pain is initiated when there is some problem with the following five systems of our body cardiac system pulmonary system vascular system musculoskeletal system and gastrointestinal system Now we'll discuss the cardiac diseases which initiate chest pain which includes coronary artery disease cad such as angina or myocardial infarction aortic stenosis and pericarditis Now we'll know about the pulmonary diseases which initiate chest pain the term pulmonary means lungs or relating to the lungs pneumonia pleuritis and pneumothorax these are those few pulmonary diseases which initiate chest pain now we'll talk about the vascular diseases which initiate chest pain the vascular diseases are those diseases which interrupt our circulation and the vascular diseases which cause chest pain are aortic dissection and pulmonary embolism we will talk about these two Now we'll talk about muscle pain as there are many people who misdiagnose their musculoskeletal issue with chest pain. Arthritis of shoulder or spine, cervical disc disease and costochondritis. These are the musculoskeletal problems which initiate chest pain and most of the people misdiagnose it. The gastrointestinal tract is the tract from the mouth to the anus which includes all the organs of digestive system in humans and other animals. Reflux is of agitus, peptic ulcer and esophageal spasm are the diseases which cause chest pain. There are many people who experience chest pain because of some emotional issues, 
relationship breakups and press disorders even if you stress about something it also causes chest pain now we'll discuss in detail about angina and many other problems which causes chest pain angina means discomfort it is usually described as severe pain in chest heaviness pressure squeezing or sensation of constriction in the chest the pain often spreads towards the shoulder arm and neck which indicate inadequate blood supply to the heart it may be described as aching or burning pain difficulty in breathing indigestion now we'll talk about myocardial infarction it is similar to angina in distribution but it is of greater intensity and longer duration mi may be accompanied by perspiration nausea and hypotension now we'll talk about pulmonary embolism infarction of the segment of the lung or the chest wall pleura can cause sharp chest pain similar to mi it occurs when there is inadequate blood supply to one or both lungs causing shortness of breath sob and rapid heart rate how musculoskeletal problems causes chest pain we are going to discuss it now people often misinterpret muscle pain with chest pain and create a panic remember chest pain due to musculoskeletal disorder is always localized pain may be sharp lasting for few seconds or may be dull that persists for several hours or days local tenderness over the rib and the coastal cartilage pain follows this pattern when it is due to some musculoskeletal disorder squeezing pain in chest similar to mi history of heartburn and food regurgitation these are the important clues that chest pain is due to esophageal spasm heart ache stress and breaking relationships also leads to chest pain when it is due to some emotional issues the pain will follow the following pattern of pain the patient will complain of chest discomfort in the form of chest tightness lasting for 30 minutes to an hour pain in the left arm it may be sharp in a very brief located mostly near the left nipple investigations for chest pain the following tests are used to diagnose the cause of chest pain ecg echocardiogram etd that stands for exercise tolerance test cardiac enzymes ct scan and blood test we can identify the cause of chest pain by keeping these differences in mind by remembering the difference in the pain pattern intensity and duration of the pain always remember that all chest pains are not leading to heart failure you can differentiate an acute and chronic case of chest pain by it the medical study tells that every pain disease or syndrome can be reduced by a healthy diet exercise and a healthy lifestyle you just need to try it as in this world nothing is impossible the word impossible itself says i am possible in the next few videos i will share with you the best clues which will help you in decision making if you suffer with chest pain due to any cause found this video informative share it with your friends and subscribe this channel i'll be back with another video